Yo, check it out. So you know how some animals be all cute, tiny and delicate, right? But hold up, if you peep the title of this video, you gotta know we ain't about that small fry life. Nah, bro, we talking about some beasts that are straight up massive. Like they take up the whole screen and then some. We're talking about some seriously huge creatures that actually walk this earth for real. Number 15, enormous cow, check it out. So you gotta hear about this cow named Knickers, right? Like with a name like that, you gotta wonder if his owner's got some serious love for him, you feel me? But yo, it ain't just his name that's making waves. It's his size, bro. Knickers be standing tall at six feet four inches and weighing in at a whopping 1,400 kilograms. Yo, that's like a straight up monster of a steer, no cap. Now you know, cows ain't always the most exciting animals on the block. But yo, they hold it down with the essentials like milk and meat, you know what I'm saying? Plus, word on the street is they make dope companions too. Jeff Pearson, Knickers homie, says this cow's got the whole town buzzing, even the internet's blowing up about him. With headlines popping worldwide, Pearson's getting hit with inquiries left and right. Everybody itching to see what's the deal with Knickers. And get this, they holding it down in Perth, Australia, where they all about them big things, you dig? Like, they got the big watermelon, the big banana, the big prawn, and even the big potato. So it's no shocker that Knickers, the big steer, joining that lineup of legends. Pearson thinks it's all just a bit of a novelty, but yo, I gotta think fading anytime soon, you feel me? All right, fam, check it out. It's time to dive into something a little out there. This horse right here, yo, it's a straight up beast. One of the biggest draft horses you'll find on this planet, known as the Dutch Draft. These Dutch horses, they can get massive, like for real. But lucky for us, they're known to keep it cool, you know what I'm saying? Otherwise, they'd be kicking gubbins left and right. With all that muscle, these horses stay busy with draft work, holding it down like champs. The one in the pick? Bruh. It's one of the largest ones alive, tipping the scales at almost 800 kilograms. Crikey, imagine riding that beast. It's like a wild ride waiting to happen. Number 14, Big Jake, world's tallest horse yo. Let me tell you about Big Jake, the world's tallest horse. This dude ain't just any old horse, nah. He's got a name that matches his size. Big Jake holds the Guinness World Record for being the tallest horse, and that's straight up awesome, you feel me? This Belgian gelding horse has blown minds all over the globe with his jaw-dropping height. Standing at a towering six feet and six inches without even wearing shoes, Big Jake officially claimed his title back in January 2010. And yo, he's been holding on to it ever since, straight up to 2018. Bagging a Guinness World Record ain't no joke, man, and Big Jake got all the love and attention he deserved. People were rolling up to Smoky Hollow Farm in Poinette, Wisconsin, just to get a glimpse of this majestic dude. His owner, Jerry Gilbert, said life for Big Jake got real busy once he hit the record books, but yo, he's handling it like a champ. Folks are straight up shocked by just how massive he is. And for those who couldn't make it to see him in person, they could peep him online, racking up over 4 million views on the Guinness World Records YouTube channel in 2012 alone. Now that's what I call impressive. You feel me? Number 13, Liger Yo. Picture this, you're out here, crowned as the biggest living cat on the whole dang planet. You'd be feeling like the king of the jungle, right? That's Hercules for you. This big dude right here? Yeah, that's Apollo rolling through at the Myrtle Beach Safari in South Carolina, USA. He's no ordinary cat though. He's a liger, a mix of a lion and a tigress. Straight up legendary. Check this out. Apollo's stretching out at a total length of 3.33 meters and tipping the scales at a hefty 418 kilograms. Homies chowing down on almost 14 kilograms a meter day. Yeah, that's like a whole two year old in weight. Now, Hercules ain't alone in this game. He's got a bro named Sinbad, a bit taller, but not as heavy, and four nephews named Yeti, Odin, Samson, and Apollo, all born in 2014, making them some of the first white ligers ever seen. Now Yeti, he's the big boss of the crew, but who knows if he'll match up to his namesake, am I right? These ligers, they ain't your average cats, nah. They rock that lion-like face and striped body with stripes that go from dark to light, depending on their mix. And guess what? Like most tigers, they love them some water, straight up chilling and swimming like it's no big deal. These cats are social and laid back, just like lions kicking it in captivity. Number 12, Lurch, world's biggest horn. Check out Lurch, holding it down as the world's biggest horn, yeah. Gotta keep it real, I kinda feel bad for my man Lurch. I mean, look at him. 
His headgear is next level, straight up impressive. But imagine trying to navigate through trees every day with that kind of gear on your dome. That's some serious hustle right there. But yo, Lurch ain't playing around. He's making history with possibly the biggest set of horns ever seen on a steer, straight up legendary. His owner, Janice Wolf, knows what's up. She's all about recognizing his unique style and giving him props in the Guinness World Records. And honestly, I'm with her on that one. Lurch deserves some serious love just for keeping his head up with them heavy horns. Word on the street is that Lurch got officially measured by not one, but two vets, just to make sure they got it right. And yo, them horns ain't playing either, stretching a massive seven feet long from tip to tip and weighing in at 100 pounds each. That's some heavyweight gear right there. Lurch is repping that Ankylotusi breed known as the Cattle of Kings, holding it down for African tribes and all. Now, Watusi cattle, they ain't no joke with their huge horns, but Lurch's horns, they're on a whole nother level. You feel me? Number 11, biggest worm in the world, yo. Check it out, fam. We talking about the biggest worm in the game. Now, I ain't gonna front, worms ain't my thing, you dig? Snakes, worms, anything wriggling? Got me squirming in my seat, ya. But yo, peep this, we talking about the Eureka's Unisinctus, aka the fat innkeeper worm. This bad boy's straight chilling in the Bohai Gulf in China, and sometimes you'll catch them kicking it off the coasts of Japan and Korea too. These suckers ain't playing when it comes to size, clocking in at a whopping 30 centimeters long? That's some next level stuff for a worm, you feel? They rock in this yellow and brown vibe that ain't exactly my cup of tea. But hey, to each their own, right? And get this, they ain't just hanging out. They out here hustling as detritivores, living that burrow life in sand and mud. Now hold up, cause it gets real interesting. In Korea, these worms ain't just chilling. They on the menu, ya. Yeah? They getting served up raw with salt and sesame oil, fried with veggies, or even dried and powdered for that extra flavor punch. And check it, they ain't just for eating. Nah, they making moves in the fishing scene too. Throw them in your tackle box and you got yourself some primo bait for snag and flounder and sea bream. Now that's what I call a win-win, am I right? Number 10, world's biggest hamster. Yo peeps, check it out. We talking about the world's biggest hamster or so we thought. You know how hamsters are those cute, tiny pets we used to have back in the day? Yeah, they usually fit right in the palm of your hand, right? But hold up, cause we got something different in the house. Meet the capybara fam. This beast ain't playing around. It's like a supersized hamster straight out of South America, holding down the title for the biggest rodent on the planet. Ain't that wild? So, peeps be mistaking these capybaras for giant hamsters, keeping them in their backyards and all. But yo, they got it all wrong. If your homie's rocking a capybara, you might want to drop them a line, let them know what's up. Melanie Tippledass, reppin' from Buda, Texas, had her mind blown when she met one of these capybaras during a trip to Venezuela. Her kid was all over it loving on that capybara like it was family. Soon as they got back home, it was game on. They wanted one for themselves. Melanie tracked down Kaplan Ruse at this rare animal farm in Texas when he was just 11 days old, yo. Can you believe it? Dude's grown a ton since then. And check this, Kaplan Ruse ain't your average rodent. Nah, he's living the high life, chilling in warm baths and taking dips in the pool. Now that's the life, ain't it? Number nine, Hulk, the pit bull, yo, check it out. We got Hulk in the house, and I ain't talking about the green dude from the comics. Nah, we talking about a pit bull that's tearing up the scales at a whopping 173 pounds. And get this, he's only 17 months old. That's straight up insane, right? But hold up, cause he's still growing. Hulk ain't done blowing minds yet. Now pit bulls, they got a rep for being tough and all, but don't let that fool ya. Hulk's an American pit bull terrier with a heart of gold, seriously. When you see him kicking it with his human and furry fam, you'll melt like butter on a hot day. He's the baby of the crew, but he's also the most handsome, no cap. His vibe alone flips the script on what folks think about his breed. Hulk's proof that big ain't always mean and scary. Now, Hulk's not your average lapdog, but he's got a heart as big as his size. He'd make the ultimate wingman, no doubt. And get this, he's not just big, he's the biggest pit bull ever seen, and he ain't done growing yet. Can you even imagine? Marlon Grannon, the dude who owns Dark Dynasty K9, is Hulk's main man. He says Hulk's a real gem, but his size might cut his time short. Man, we're rooting for Hulk to defy the odds and keep on rocking. Here's hoping he's with us for a long time to come. Number eight, largest rabbit in the world. Yo peeps, check it out. 
We got Darius holding it down as the biggest bunny on the block, standing tall at over 4 feet and packing a hefty 22.2 kilos. But hold on to your hats, cause his son Jeff's coming up fast and he's aiming to snatch that title right out of Darius's paws. Coco Puff, he's the chill bunny in the house. No cages for this dude. He's bouncing all over the place like he owns the joint. He's clocking in at 3 feet 8 inches and still got some growing to do. Annette Edwards, the bunny boss, might just end up with two giants on her hands, and that's no small feat. Now, these fellas ain't your run-of-the-mill bunnies, nah. They're repping that continental giant breed, originally bred for meat. But Darius and Jeff, they flipped the script, showing they're more than just munching machines. They crash in dog-sized crates instead of those tiny hutches and chow down on 2,000 carrots and 700 apples a year. And don't forget the hay. They tear through a bale a week, leaving Annette with one hefty grocery bill. But yo, despite the munch and madness, if you ever dreamed of having a bunny buddy the size of a German Shepherd, look no further. Annette says, these dudes are smart, well-behaved, and they'll be your ride-or-die pals for life. Who needs a guard dog when you got giant bunnies holding it down? Number 7. World's tallest dog, yo. Check it out. Zeus, the Great Dane, was a legend in the making, standing tall at a whopping one point 118 meters or 44 inches when he was measured back in October 2011. Denise Dorlag and her crew from Otsego, Michigan were the lucky peeps who got to call him their own. They knew they were in for a wild ride when they named him Zeus. Big name for a big dog, am I right? This dude wasn't just tall, he was a whole lot of dog, tipping the scales at a hefty 70 kilograms. And let me tell you, he had the appetite to match. Zeus could chow down over 13 kilograms of grub every two weeks. Talk about a hungry hound. Now, when it came to picking a pup, Denise's hubby wanted something small and cute, but she was all about that big dog life. Zeus won the day, and man, did he live up to his name. Standing tall on his hind legs, he could reach a jaw-dropping 2.23 meters. No regrets on that decision. But here's the kicker. Despite his massive size, Zeus was as chill as they come. He had nothing but love for his human crew and got along just fine with other animals. He was so tall that he could even drink straight from the sink tap like a boss. Talk about convenience. Sadly, Zeus crossed the Rainbow Bridge in September 2014, just three years after his record-breaking moment. He was only five, but his legacy lives on. Rest in peace, big fella. You'll always be remembered as the tallest dog in town. Number six, the biggest spider on the planet. Hold on to your hats, folks, because we're diving into the hairy eight-legged world of spiders. Now, if you're not a fan of our arachnid friends, you might want to look away, because things are about to get real spooky. Spiders, you either love them or hate them. Some folks think they're creepy crawlies best avoided, while others see them as nature's little pest control squad. Yup, they might give you the heebie-jeebies, but they do a darn good job at keeping pesky flies in check. But wait, there's more. Brace yourselves, because we're talking about the granddaddy of all spiders, the desert a wolf spider, straight out of Madeira, Portugal. This bad boy ain't messing around, with a body stretching up to a whopping 1.6 inches. And get this, it's got these funky white polka dots on its legs, like it's wearing spider socks or something. Not exactly a fashion statement, if you ask me. Now, why the name wolf, you wonder? Well. These spiders ain't your average web spinners, they're hunters. Yup, they prefer a good old pounce over a web any day. Talk about a bold move, am I right? So, there you have it folks. The desert a wolf spider holding court as the biggest spider on the block. It's a wild world out there, ain't it? Number five, biggest cat in the world. All right, let's talk about some cool cats. The Maine Coons, to be precise. These felines are the kings and queens of the domestic cat world, and they've got the size to prove it. Now, what's interesting about Maine Coons is that despite their impressive stature, they ain't got no direct ties to their wildcat cousins. At least, not in recent history. These cats are as chill as they come, according to their humans. Hailing all the way from Maine, these big furballs can tip the scales at a hefty 15 pounds for the ladies and a whopping 15 to 25 pounds for the gents. Talk about big cats on the block. But here's the kicker. Maine Coons don't hit their peak size until they're about three years old. Some of them are still growing even at five. And let's not forget about their majestic coats. Two to three inches deep, topped with a bushy tail that's the envy of the neighborhood. Sure, these cats might not be the cuddliest lap warmers, but they sure know how to charm their way into your heart. Plus, they're a ton of fun. 
owners swear they never outgrow their playful kitten vibes. Now, whether that's a good thing or not, well, I'll let you be the judge of that. Number 4. Goliath Frog Check it out. We're talking about the Goliath Frog, the heavyweight champ of the frog world. This frog ain't just named Goliath for kicks, it's the real deal. The biggest frog you'll ever lay eyes on. Picture this, it can stretch up to a whopping 12.5 inches long and weigh as much as 7.2 pounds. That's like having a frog that's as hefty as your average house cat. Now that's what I call a colossal amphibian. According to the folks at Guinness, this frog takes the crown for being the largest frog on the planet. What's wild is that it all starts from humble beginnings, just your regular tadpole, nothing fancy. But here's the kicker. While other frogs stop growing, the Goliath just keeps on going, like it's got no end in sight. It's like the Hulk of the frog world, but less green and more slimy. Now, here's the real mystery. These frogs outlive humans by a long shot, yet we still don't know squat about them. How long do they live? Who knows? How much bigger can they get? Your guess is as good as mine. And don't even get me started on how many different Goliath versions are out there. It's a froggy mystery. But fear not, my friends, because scientists are on the case. They're digging into the Goliath's world, trying to crack the code on their behavior in homes. With any luck, we'll figure out how to keep these magnificent frogs kicking for generations to come. Let's hop to it and save these froggy giants from going extinct. Number three, the Japanese spider crab. All right, hold on to your hats, folks. We're diving into the world of the Japanese spider crab. But don't worry, this one's more crab-tastic than spidery. So arachnophobes, you're safe for now. The Japanese spider crab is like the king of the ocean, chilling out in the waters around Japan. Get this, it's got the longest leg span of any critter with a whopping 12 feet from claw to claw. Talk about a stretch, and that's not all. Its body can grow up to 16 inches wide and tip the scales at a hefty 19 kilos or more. Now that's what I call a big crab. What really makes this crab stand out is its style. It's rocking an orange body with cool white spots on its legs, giving it that unique flair. Kind of like a rock star among crabs, wouldn't you say? But here's the kicker. Despite looking like something out of a monster movie, these crabs are surprisingly chill around us humans. They hang out way down deep, like 500 to 1,000 feet down, where the water's as cold as 10 degrees Celsius. Brr, that's chilly. Now, here's the twist. Some folks consider these crabs a tasty treat, but there's a push to keep them safe from overfishing and extinction. Let's give these ocean giants the respect they deserve and keep them swimming for generations to come. Number two, Medusa, the biggest snake. Meet Medusa, the colossal snake whose name fits her record-breaking size perfectly. This slithery superstar holds the Guinness World Record for being the biggest snake on the planet. When I got Medusa, she was about 26, 28 inches long, about as big around as my index finger. That's how her journey began. Now, she calls Kansas City's Edge of Hell and Beast Haunted Houses her home, where she shines as a star attraction. Performing under pressure is just another day in the life of this reticulated python. Despite her massive size, Medusa is a sensitive soul. She tires easily, but her devoted owners ensure she's well cared for. She enjoys hearty meals and soothing swims in the pool to aid her recovery. In 2011, she measured a staggering 25 feet and 2 inches, smashing the world record for snake size. Weighing in at an impressive 350 pounds, Medusa's stats are jaw-dropping. Most snakes of her species top out at 20 feet, making her size even more remarkable. In the wild, her weight fluctuates depending on her diet and meal frequency. But hey, no surprises there for this magnificent serpent. Number 1. World's Biggest Crocodile ever measured in captivity. Let's talk about the world's biggest crocodile ever measured in captivity. Now, we've all seen those monstrous crocs in movies like Lake Placid, but the one we're about to discuss isn't quite as terrifying, though still impressive. Keep in mind, though, that what you see on the internet isn't always what it seems. Images can be manipulated, making animals appear larger or smaller depending on who's watching. Videos, too, can be tricky to gauge. So, how big was this colossal croc? Meet Yutan, a hybrid of saltwater and Siamese crocs, born in 1964 at the Samut Prakan Crocodile Farm near Bangkok, Thailand. Named after the farm owner's son, Yutan packs a bite force of about 5,000 pounds per square inch. 
That's more than two tons. Stretching a whopping 5.5 meters long, Utah now calls Alligator Adventure Home, a reptile haven next to Barefoot Landing in North Myrtle Beach, one of South Carolina's top tourist spots. Now, these creatures are impossible to ignore. These animals demand serious commitment. And hey, don't forget to check out our other cool stuff popping up on your screen right now. Until next time.